Do you want to lead us? Do you want to intro us, Eld? Okay. What do we usually say? I don't know, just um... <laughs> hey, welcome to OC Panic Hour! I'm JC Chase. I've got Eld and uh, Kale with me today. We're gonna draw some Hi. monsters. That's a good intro, right? That's good enough. <laughs> um, oh, are we not using that? <laughs> yeah, I think we are. I, oh, that, was, okay. that was my. Nice. That was me saying we're using it. Um, <laughs> cool. Intros. Um, yeah. I don't know. What else would we say? We're the venture crew. Oh, no, that's we good. Like to do I'm good with that. Stuff. Okay. Um, yeah. So a little. Uh, normally, OC Panic Hour is. Uh, it's an hour-long challenge, and we each choose five references, and we do it based on a theme. But today, we're doing it a little differently. We chose two references each, and we're going to all use the same references. So there's going to be six references total that we have to try to incorporate into our drawing. We don't know what they all are yet, so we're about to find out. All right, so... Oh, wow. Aww. Those are cool. Yeah. So we've got some kind of winged creature mm -hmm. and... Wait up tail. <laughs> a... I don't know, like a demon dog made of horror, yeah. so I don't know what that is, but that's cool. Kind of reminds me of the creature from uh, Princess Mononoke. So yeah, that yeah, that's a good... Aspect very appealing. Yeah. Okay, you guys ready to reveal elves? Yep. Uh, yeah. Click, click. What? Is that a little doll? <laughs> what is that? Neat. It's like a doll with a mask and fur Oh, it's hair. so creepy. I love it. I like it. the fluffiness. Can I just oh, say I thought it was real cute. quick? I think... My gut reaction was doll. Yeah, I can incorporate it. platypus. How the fuck? <laughs> yeah, platypus was an interesting choice. Uh, I also chose an animal for one of mine. So if you guys want to oh, cool. click those spoilers, right, let's see. Yeah. Boom. Boom. Oh boy. Oh, uh, JC, why? <laughs> that cat is so cool. Yeah, it's a likoi. They're like werewolf cats, and uh, oh, yeah. and then like a contortionist. Just because I was thinking like Silent Hill, that kind of. Yeah, yeah. You know. Now, one of my possible references was kind of in that same vein, so all right, that works. That I think works. this is going to be hard though to. Uh, oh yeah. Get them all. I don't know. We'll see. I'm gonna set a timer on my phone. Cool. And um, you guys ready? Yes. All right. Oh wait, no, I drew in the background. <laughs> oh, wait, what? Uh, okay, it's, oh, it's cool. You ready? <laughs> you good? Yeah. yeah. All right, yeah. and start. Okay. Oof, okay. I have no idea what I'm doing yet. I don't. I don't know how to draw animals. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> that might be a good good thing to learn in a monster challenge. Yeah, maybe. Mm. Oh shoot! I already feel like my canvas. I have it like uh, tall. I feel like it should be wide. It'd probably be easier. Press C and you can fix it. Yeah. Do you want it? Oh, the can okay. My canvas. I, f I feel like it yeah. should be like um like a la landscape instead of portrait to figure mm -hmm. out a, a creature, mm -hmm. an animal. Let's see. Yeah. Honestly, okay. I feel like idea. the contortionist was like a weird loop for this. Like, yeah. I think that's, um I don't know. I don't know how to work that in, even though that was my idea. <laughs> Good job. I just, I don't it's know, so I was fun. thinking like Silent Hill, kind of like, everybody looks like their back is broken, or, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. that was... Yeah, no, I dig that. That's great for monsters. Kind of the vibe, like, I was feeling. I think my biggest challenge is just remember what's front and what's back. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because, uh, you know... Mm -hmm. I feel it's like, still uh, just the goddamn platypus. I don't know <laughs> where you think that's in. the odd part about the whole thing. Honestly, yeah, no, be because it's only got so many like platypus details. You know, like it's like, do I put a duck bill on this? Do I put little duck feet, or do I put a beaver tail on it? Because I can't just have like a potato body. <laughs> I mean, it that, can be that's a literally body. a platypus. I have described the entirety of the animal. I mean, uh, it also I has like. You could be. He has like hooks on his back, back feet. You could be inspired poisonous. by like the colors or like the shininess That's of true. its like you know it's kind of yeah. slick in water. Okay. There's okay. there's stuff you could pull from that. That's true. That's true. I would, I would think beyond just like the structure of the creature a little bit. Yeah. 
That's why. That's why it's a weird challenge. Through that. Uh, you know, we'll just do a couple of odd marks and see what inspires me. I feel like I'm gonna be really quiet this whole episode because I'm just like focused. <laughs> like, oh, what do I do? Well, here I'd I'd like to ask you too. Uh, what are some of your favorite monsters you've seen in media, and why? Oh, geez. Uh, okay. I, you know what really always stood out to me? Um, I I do like I don't really play Silent Hill games, but I watch Mikey play them. And yeah. uh, one of my favorite things was um, I forget what it was called, uh, but there's a a creature that it's based on two people and it's like so it's like this this guy and then there's like a woman like tied to his back is kind of how it's okay uh formed yeah. and and there's like a story about like they're suffering and they like you know like unrequited love they couldn't be together kind of a thing and it can like flip over and like walk different i think based on i don't know it's, it, it's very like huh. disturbing but i thought it was like kind of like this weird romantic sad sort of That's element cool. that i yeah, yeah. i liked about that like i i think it's kind of cool when a, a monster there's a why to, to why it is the way it is. I, I think that's yeah, kind of fun. That's always neat. And how about you, Ellen? Um, 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 <laughs> I like, um, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if your answer is you don't like really monsters, that's yeah. valid, too. I do love orcs, but are they considered monsters? Uh, I think that's uh, bad publicity. I don't think they're monsters. <laughs> yeah. What about you, Kale? I know you're into monsters, so I'm curious what you oh, say. Oh, man. Um, so, nothing in the world creeps me out quite as much as The Thing uh, from the movie John Carpenter's The Thing. Uh, that, to me, is just like the pinnacle of mix mixing monsters with psychological fear, and I really dig it for that reason. There's a, this notion of, like, anyone you know could be acting completely them but it's not them mm. and that that, that person scary. doesn't even know that they're not who they are and that wraps back around to like what if i'm this thing and i'm just i'm not aware until i'm like going to consume my prey that i finally cornered you know oh yeah like, that's... that's such a screwed up notion i love it it's just ugh. that is a screw I, I guess I, I don't really know that much about the thing i didn't know all that that's that's really interesting yeah it's i think i've seen wild stuff I think I've seen the most recent interpretation of the thing. Yeah, that lost a lot of the, the magic. I Probably. Think. Um, you know, not that that's uncommon, but. Yeah, it uh, just happens. Yeah, exactly. Mm. Are you guys struggling yet? Hitting any walls, or how's it going? Um, um, I forgot that the tail is supposed to go above the butt. <laughs> so I accidentally <laughs> drew the tail. Oh, under the bat idea. because okay. the proportions are so odd. <coughs> Do you guys already have a reference you're kind of favoring, or? Um, I'm trying. What I'm actually doing is thumbnailing, um, trying to see if I can find inspiration out of each of these being yeah, the, the frontliner. Yeah. Um, but you know, nothing yet really. I'd really mm. like to just do something that's super creepy but I haven't quite found it yet yeah um. uh, I'm having a hard time already like I'm trying to figure out a pose that like it works for what I'm trying to do and I, I really I, I mean know. can't you use the pose reference that you gave us I'm trying to and then I thought <laughs> I'm basically just copying like a contortion like I don't want it to be necessarily like here's this contortionist but now they're freaky looking you know sure. Uh, sure. But, I, but i'm inspired by it for sure mm. Ooh, i just had a cool idea all right i dig that hmm. i think i always have a easier Ooh. time sorry drawing. i know we're recording but be right back i think my animals are fighting oh no there you are should I pause? Well, while that's happening, my cat wanna go outside. I know, Riley's <laughs> right trying to get too. in my door. Hold on, let's, let's all, we're all gonna have a disadvantage. Cool. Hi, come on in. You're a jerk. You're a jerk. Alright, I'm back. Where's everybody else at? <clears throat> 
Am I back first? Uh, no, cool. I think I was back first. No. No. <laughs> No, I wanted right. to win. Sorry about that. No, we all we all had to deal with our animals for a second. Oddly, <laughs> I was like, I can let my cat out. I'm like, I let my dog in. So we all lost a couple, like a minute there. <laughs> I think my heart, the hardest part for me is definitely the, the face. I'm not overthinking the face. I feel like I feel like I'm already fine with mine. I don't cool. have a face. I just don't. No face. Ooh. Um, I mean, no face works. Yeah. I'm it's it's kind of one mask. of the ideas I'm toying with. <coughs> um, okay. I'm really curious yeah, how cool. we all interpret this challenge, though. Like, I think. Yeah. I think there's um, a lot. You know what? I think that design's pretty strong. I'm going to just go with that instead of building out more. Because I'm crunched for time. Yeah. How much time do we have? We have. I have no idea. Uh, hold on, my phone. There we go. Uh, we have we have fifty one minutes though. We're good. Mm. Slightly over fifty one minutes. I'm not even ten minutes in. Tight. Okay. I just don't know when I'm happy with this. Yeah, I think that's kind of the thing about like a monster challenge that's interesting. I'm not used to drawing monsters either, so. No, same. Boy. Yeah, no. This is definitely like a Caleb has the advantage. <laughs> kind of a thing. Like always. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's drop that down. I love the silhouette that I'm getting here. This is this is fun. Okay. Yeah. I'm oh, my so silhouette! It definitely looks like something. <laughs> I'm stuck on mine actually for that because I just feel. <sighs> I feel like I keep inching towards something that I'm like, wait, that's kind of a cat and heat pose. <laughs> I'm not into this. It's kind of a what? Like a cat in heat kind of pose. Oh. <laughs> like I was oh, just inching no. towards something that felt like that. And I was like, nope, that's not yeah. where I wanted to go with that. I'm moving over to color. Of course you are. I, I would color? expect There's nothing. a lot of brown in our reference. I'm going to go for brown. I would expect nothing Just less. because. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. There's a lot of brown It'll be in all of our references. Yeah. yeah, see? So we, we thought about the same thing. I think, I feel like, I don't know, I feel like it's so hard to just mesh them all together because they are so different. Yeah. Yeah. There's like no, there's no theme around them. Yeah, no, kind of not. So, uh, whoops. Alright, I think I'm just going to oh, give up on that part of it. Maybe. This is so refreshing. Why? I have not just made up some horrible creature in so long. This is great. I love it. Mm. Yeah, this is definitely not my forte. I've I've dabbled a little <laughs> bit in like uh, coming up with like a creature before, um, but it's it's something that like I, I remember doing and feeling like I was looking up a lot of other artwork and trying to get inspired and like really yeah you know thinking a lot about like how to do it. Um, the whole vibe of this changed when I changed. I think I think therefore I am <laughs> and yes. this is definitely turning into something I'm thinking about oh <laughs> <laughs> that's right what I have there? to say yeah I guess <laughs> <laughs> I guess uh, okay you know, so, so as someone who enjoys drawing monsters kill do you think yeah. that like they need to be rooted in something that like exists in like anatomy that makes sense like this thing like do you really have to really think about like how it should move or is kind of the point like it, it's okay it, if it doesn't look like it would move because maybe it moves in a weird way or I think it absolutely depends on what you're going for um, and like what the setting is you know like if you're going for a realistic setting then yeah you need to think about like locomotion and all that like are you making a monster that's an alien that's supposed to be on another planet and you have to consider its ecosystem? Are you making some eldritch horror wherein you're kind of intentionally shooting for something that doesn't work the way we expect things to? Right. Um, you know, it's just asking for very, very different things depending on what those answers are. And I think in terms of monster and like 
if you're framing that up is therefore horror, mm -hmm. then to me the best elements you can introduce are things that are familiar but are done wrong. Okay. Or that yeah. aren't, you know, that aren't quite right. That's why Silent Hill is scary because it's human things that are broken, broken and still yeah, moving disturbing. and their motivations are very, you know, not clear. Um, so things like that, I think, especially whenever I'm trying to go for something creepy. Uh, yeah. You know, I, I'm a big fan of uh, the body horror kind of stuff. A again, when done right, I don't like gore or just yeah, me too. torture porn kind of stuff yeah. at all. I find that really boring. Yeah. Um, yeah but, same. you know, like the thing, like, to go back to that, I think does it really well because, like, it's not just that it's wrong looking, it's that it's wrong looking for a reason. It's wrong looking as a, a an adaptation. It's wrong looking intentionally. Like, that, that to me sense. is much creepier. Yeah, no, that totally makes sense. do. I think I definitely prefer the psychological yeah. scariness. Because, oh, whoa, way too much erased. The thing is, like, if you just have, like, a general monster of some sort, like, it's some lizard creature or whatever, you know, dinosaur, like, it looks familiar, it looks correct, Yeah. your body pretty much processes that as, like, a known thing at some point, and it's less scary. Yeah. You know, and that's why, like, showing the monster often takes the horror out of the film. No, that makes sense. Because you're just like, oh, okay, it's just some... Yeah. But yeah. you can subvert that by having the creature be kind of unfathomable. Like, even when you see it, you're like, I don't understand what I'm what looking, I'm looking at. at. Yeah. Yeah. And that keeps it fresh. I, I dig that. You know, I... And this is coming from someone who cannot handle playing horror games at all. Like Silent really? Hill messes me up. I can't really? handle that it. Really, that is interesting. Yeah. I wouldn't guess. <laughs> I think the only horror genre that really, really scares me is the Asian horror. Oh yeah. That's because true. the Asian horror it doesn't follow rules. Like the Western horror has like all these rules. Yeah. And that's why it's so scary to just see like little girls with like long dark hair just ready to f murder you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so creepy Ooh. like yeah that's that's a great example of like if anyone watching has seen uh any junji ito work he's a manga artist and writer and he does oh, okay. horror stuff and god it's just some of the most upsetting things to look at because he he bases it heavily in like uh japanese folklore and, yeah. and a lot of body horror that's like again it's like it's familiar but it's wrong and it it I'm works. So stuck on this thing. I can't figure out what I'm drawing. I uh -oh. think. I have like. I think the only like Western horror that system. really scares me is like the Starker type. Oh yeah. Or just anything that's like through a window. Yeah. <laughs> I've always been afraid of something that goes through a window. Mm. <laughs> like we we watched a lot of Passport Two growing up. Mm. Um, and there was like this one episode where someone had like pretty much died I can't remember because I never finished it because it was too scary for me but they died from shock after seeing something out of the window and I was, I was like oh, no oh, wow. no <laughs> I can never ever see her out of the window ever again yo that like, reminds me I, I used to have these creepy dreams where mm -hmm. every time I went to the window there would be these like figures floating there and oh, they'd geez. be like they'd be like they had like um, stripes clothing and kind of like weird like you know, like like pure black eyes, kind of. Oh wow! And they okay. like and like every time you open like any like if you go to any window, they'd be there. I uh, you it, just staring at you. Yeah, <laughs> and I just have nightmares, have recurring nightmares, about them. Um, Damn. Yeah, they were really creepy. Yeah, that would I do should it. draw them. I never. You should. Yeah, yeah I should try. Yeah, I I've drawn my exactly fears. Like, but do you I guys have any like recurring this. nightmare stuff or anything that like has yeah, inspired yeah. your yeah. art or? I, oh, yeah. I I have like a never I don't have it anymore but as a kid I would have a reoccurring uh, nightmare where I was lost in my own village and I would climb up on like the mountain where there's still like houses and I would walk into like this empty old house with like where an old couple just stares in front of sits in front of a TV and just stares at it. Oh god. Oh god. That's so creepy. And that's the whole dream. <laughs> that's creepy. 
Yeah. 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 What about you, Cal? I had, uh, well, several really, but one that uh, was like recurring for a bit was this uh, thing that was, God, how do you describe it? So let's just say like a, you know, a big ogre-ish type thing. Doesn't look like any kind of like fantasy monster, but um, sort of crustacean, I guess. And its back was gelatinous, like a jellyfish Ooh. sort of texture, like translucent. Okay. And it wouldn't, it didn't have a mouth. It would eat you through its back. So it's like it would grab me and like Ew. stuff me into its back and I would slowly suffocate as like its back like turned into tentacles and pulled me into it. Um, and this thing would like appear in my house, you know, like oh, there God. was no getting away yeah, from yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, um, And it's, I, I don't know if you guys have ever had dreams where it's like you wake up and you feel like maybe you weren't breathing while you were asleep. And, and oh, yeah. there was a period of time where that was happening to me. And that's when oh, I would have those scary. nightmares. So yeah. That's super scary. I think I'm very lucky that I haven't had any like... What's it called when you, you, you're you awake but you can't move? Oh, sleep paralysis? Oh, oh I get yeah. that sometimes. That's really scary. Yeah, my that. sister used to have it. Yeah, it sucks. Ugh. Mikey gets it too. Um, it's weird because sometimes we'll be having it and then we, we're just like laying there hoping the other person like will get that, like, I need help, wake me up. Like, yeah. Help us somehow. It's, yeah, it's really that scary. Yeah, sucks. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Boy. I think. So I've incorporated one, two three four <clears throat> I, I need to incorporate here. the other two here yeah I'm missing a couple of things but I think I mostly have my own stuff right now I mean I kind of started with mine I think that makes sense right like yeah we we pick them like yeah they say that's no, fair I, my my biggest problem is definitely adding the the flying dude Oh, I kind of oh, cheated yeah. on that. I, t I took a very small detail from that and used it. Yeah, <laughs> oh, <of> actually, me <laughs> too. Cheating, I hear. Cheating. Well, I'm just saying I, you know, I didn't use a big element of it necessarily. I just mm -hmm, kind of... Mm -hmm. Yeah. Fine. All right, by the way, we have 40 <laughs> minutes left. So we're oh, okay. 20 minutes in. We're good. We're good. Yeah, I think we're good. I, You know what? I'll admit I'm having a hard time with the platypus. I'm not going to lie. Yep. Good. Yeah, good. I'm just going to kind of <laughs> circle back around to that. I think I'm gonna steal my idea that I suggested of like I'm just gonna make it look kind of wet, <laughs> and that's my platypus <laughs> influence. Maybe a little bit with the coloring. I don't know. Yeah. Oh god, I'm like wrapping my brain, like trying to be like, what is, what is front and what is back? Mm. This is back. This is his, his butt. Me. Okay, okay, okay. But does that make sense? Is his legs going the wrong way? Yeah. <laughs> I can't tell. I'm having a hard time. I feel like mine actually, like... I mean, I, mine are definitely going the wrong way. <laughs> I feel like my anatomy, I'm trying oh, to Oh, no, they are going the wrong way. <laughs> I'm trying to make the anatomy weird, but I think I'm not... Like, I don't think I'm pushing it enough, and I'm not sure how to change that. Yeah, scribble a little. Yeah. Okay, Honestly. he has back backwards legs now. Yeah. Um, that's the thing. You know, it's that creepy thing that Kale mentioned, you know, totally did that on purpose. <laughs> Life just be like that sometimes. <laughs> you know. Uh, I think, think it don't be like that, but it do. It's true. Mm, indeed. Indeedy. I'm trying to decide if I want to get this adding... tail or not. I feel like the the cat is so mundane. That yeah. is like even harder to just implement. Oh, see, I've, I'm heavily influenced by the cat. Yeah, uh, I've got of that course. Pretty worked in, I think. Um, it's just. I'm just adding the fur on his platypus. butt to be. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, yeah, the platypus. The platypus, is platypus makes sense. Okay. He makes. Sense. Don't judge, Mr. Platypus. Oh. He did a good job. <laughs> okay. All right, I think I'm actually maybe ready to move on to color. Maybe. Yeah. It's pretty sketchy. Oh yeah, but... same same what yeah i'm not there yet but honestly i don't feel like i'm gonna really rely on color quite yeah. as much for this one gotcha. i mean what i have is pretty sketchy i i feel like um maybe i could clean it up and stuff but i just uh i kind of want to have fun with color mm -hmm. with this i think i have some ideas that 
yeah. interesting. So let's cool. try them out. We'll see. Mm. I think color mm. is actually uh, where I'm probably going to pull from some of the references I'm having a harder time incorporating. I think, uh, I think color will sort of help. Again, it's that flying thing that's just so hard for me. <laughs> yeah, I, like I literally what, just... What am I supposed to? I mean, there's a lot of things there that you can kind of look at, though. Like, it has really interesting eyes. It has really interesting feet. Yeah, I was just it's about to do the eye. Tail. It's got those, like, weird, weird I think it just doesn't make sense to have any of that on my guy. No, I get you. That's, that's fair. Hmm. Okay. Well, I'm, I'm excited to see what you did, Kale. Yeah, is this, this very is, uh, different from your normal process for creating monsters? Uh, I can't even say that because it's just been a hot minute. Honestly, like I don't know. Oh, okay. um, this is, you know, as much as like I, I feel like as we get older as artists and like fall into style habits, this is kind of freeing because I'm just like doing like oh what what feels neat right now yeah um well, actually i'm gonna bring that out because i think that's killing the silhouette um you know there's some stuff i'm not like as happy with but honestly i think this is pretty dope um gotta figure out this part though okay what am i missing stuff from got that got that Got that, got that. <coughs> hmm. I am struggling. With what? It's just a the green boy. <laughs> He's just... Oh, here we go. Okay. He's just taunting me. <laughs> He's, just... He's just, like, sticking his tongue out like, nee, 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 nee. Like, nee, you can't draw me, nee, nee. Yeah, we're, we're definitely going to have to, like, link these references in the description so people know yeah. what we're talking about. Yeah. I think I have to do what I did with Snarl and just do two drawings. Oh, okay. So, like, kind of work it out. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's Well, Snarl was pretty much done when I did my second drawing, but this guy is definitely, you know, having a, having a blast of just mocking me. Now you guys can see like how messy my drawings are when I don't have a pose reference. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, honestly, it's it's really hard to to do something in a short amount of time without a pose reference. I, I find that to be usually where I get hung up on these kind of challenges when we do like characters. Mm. Are you guys implementing the mask? Yeah, actually, it's the first thing I worked in. Uh, I'm not. Cool. Yeah, I was I was considering not adding the mask, but then I was like, hey, you know what? I just can't. Uh, I can't wait to see you guys, because I I really like uh, creatures with like masks. I think it's very creepy. I just for what I was doing, it just kind of I don't know. I wasn't drawn to that element of it yeah. necessarily. Uh, I think I think the mask is really cool, which is funny because when I first looked at it, I was like, oh, I'm definitely doing something with that mask, and then I started drawing, and I was like, mm, no, I guess not. <laughs> Boy, boy, boy. Okay, yeah, that's pretty cool. Jeez. <laughs> What's up? I was right. oh, just kind of impressed with myself, actually. This oh, is okay, good. Nice and creepy. Heck yeah. Um, just need to, let's see. Cool, whatever. <laughs> you sound so enthusiastic, Elf. I know, right? This is me every day. You usually sound like way more uh cocky. Ex yeah, that definitely yeah. that.
I think what's hard yeah. is like to fight the urge to do something that's like aesthetically pleasing. Oh um, yeah. Like I think when you're I'm definitely know, going for aesthetic. Yeah, <laughs> I, I think that's difficult though, because I I don't think that really works for something like this. No, it really. I mean, I think yes, it's working no. for me. Like I'm realizing that I need to kind of change the shape of my character's face because I was like feeling like it was maybe too cute. <laughs> Even yeah. though I wasn't going for cute, like yeah, mine is looking way too cute. cute for sure. I think I like the idea of something with a mask being cute, but once to take the mask off, it's creepy. Yeah, mm. definitely. Mm -hmm. Okay, now I'm just kind of avoiding something. All right, let's get this and then start knocking out the other. There's no reason to do it this way. Hmm. Okay. Let's yeah, I keep like off. I'm coloring, but yeah. then I'm like, wait, I'm gonna change like the shape of everything. <laughs> <laughs> Big mood. <clears throat> I guess I wasn't ready for color. I don't know. <laughs> hmm. Okay. Let's see here. I have to like remind. I I gave him multiple eyes, and I have to remind myself where I put them. Hmm. Good. Ugh, I say. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> Those are my emotions right now. Ugh. I'm having a hard time with this one part. This is silly. Um, hmm. uh, it is me sending me all, all of the negative vibes. Now. I keep like being like, wait, I want the face to look different. That's that's hard actually. Ooh, that's kind of a neat idea. That's a good way to bring that in. Okay. You're welcome. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, Elf. What what would you do without me? Clearly, I'd just fail at these challenges. Mm -hmm. Can I remind you guys that I wanted us to do a monster challenge without any references? Yeah, I don't know that I could have done that. I, Who knows? You could have, Kale, right? Yeah, yeah. I could have, but I'm very happy that we did with references because I really dig what I'm making. Oh, cool. Like, I'm going to have to use this somewhere. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Oh, I can't wait. No idea where or how, but, you know, sure. it's, it's just one of those designs that I'm like, yeah. Hmm. I feel like I'm looking at mine and I'm like, well, I don't even know what to look at. There's too much going on. <laughs> like, I don't have any yeah, kind of focal. Yeah, I feel you. What, what time are we on? That's, That's a, a good question. question. We are at a half hour. Oh, yeah. okay. Tight, 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 tight. Okay. How are you guys feeling? I, I feel good about Good, 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 good. Okay. I'm feeling t some emotions. <laughs> <laughs> Eld is feeling. <laughs> That's it. There you go. Eld is processing emotions. Eld needs some time. <laughs> I think I'm just having a really, really hard time with the face. Mm. Mm. Yeah, I, I keep coming back around on like changing my character's face. I've changed it a bunch of times now. The problem is I feel like every time I change it, it actually kind of looks like an existing animal, sort of. Like, it reminds me of something. Oh, yeah. And then I'm like, oh, I don't like that. It reminds me too much of blank, you know, whatever. Like, it was looking... <laughs> I don't know. Awkward. <laughs> I think my, my, my first drawing came out really, really dorky. Like, this is clearly a dorky character. Mm -hmm. So I just really want to just, like, level it up with a really creepy face. Nice. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, but kind of, like, know. dorky creepy. Yeah. <laughs> like, if you look at it for too long, you kind of go, ah, I mean, <laughs> it's cute, but, like, I don't want to pet it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's fair. Hmm. So I'm okay. trying to like stay cool. away from humanoid That's... shapes in the face. Oh no! Don't do that. No, like, but I'm just like creepy. I I like the roundness of what I go have have going on right now. All right, I 
think that's good on line art. Am I missing anything in particular? Besides, you know, the duck beaver. <laughs> hey, listen. It's a good reference. <laughs> yeah. I was like, I stand by this. <laughs> now it looks like a dog. Think of cats. Uh, yeah. uh, I wish I could go back like, out a little bit there. Yeah. Yeah. Mm, big mood. <laughs> but that's just life. Yeah, I don't think I should erase. I think I should have started a new layer because sometimes I'm like, wait, that was actually that was fine. Yeah. Let's do okay. Chop the. I think I'm just going to embrace the tongue. <laughs> yeah. And say that's totally the, the 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 thing I got from the green book dude. That's what I did. Hey, that's fine. Same. <laughs> mm. I, I am. I am. Cool. So we just I, created this like with all creatures with that tongue. I mean, I don't think mine's going to come across the same as, <laughs> as y'all. So I'm not nah, worried about I don't that. Think so either, is it? Who knows? Maybe we just end up with exactly the same thing. That's true. Yeah, you that, never that know. could happen. Looking at what I've got here, that's a very real chance. What could happen? Sorry, I think I. That we all just do the same thing. Oh yeah, of course. Yeah. Yeah. It's so obvious. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I mean, you know, you tend to just, you know, if you if you go with your first idea, you usually make something very generic. Right, right. So maybe we just went really, really generic with this one. Probably. Then we have to redo the whole challenge. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm okay with this. Uh. Yeah, I'm, I'm, my biggest problem really is the head of this thing. I can't. Like, I just keep changing it. I keep. I don't know. I'm having a hard time. God. Hmm. I would say, I don't know, I, again, I don't, I don't know what you're drawing, but advice I have on monsters is, like, don't get super precious about, like, making things look right, because a lot of times after you get the, the bulk of it put together, mm -hmm. the details start sort of explaining themselves to you, I, I think. No, that kind of, I mean, that makes sense. You know. We don't want logic here. <laughs> I mean, b both yes and no. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. I mean, yeah. yeah, you don't want to overthink, like, is this accurate, because... I think one way of making it creepy is just adding way too much details. Yep, yep. That's very much uh, my school of thought with it, too. It's just mm. overly textured does tend to look very unsettling to our eyes, so... That's a quick way to just make it work that's hard know? to do on like a time challenge though i feel like i'm curious unless you have like texture presets oh yeah, that's true yeah but that's are we allowed I'll to pull use out those? my monster textures that i that i already had ready to go let me oh, pull good. out my skin yeah. texture <laughs> can i use the skin texture will you let me borrow it <laughs> sure yes rip there it is <laughs> <laughs> Concept of what I'm doing, I just don't like my execution of it. <sighs> get rid of that. I don't think it needs it. Okay. How much time do we have again? Um, we have a little less than a half hour now. So, oh, we have like 23 mm. minutes. Cool. 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 Yeah, That's cool. fine. Let me just delete my whole body. <laughs> From existence. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm gone, guys. Bye. Bye. My body. Bye I'll miss you. <laughs> mm, so you're never. My villas on my computer. Ignore everything that's you know marked not safe for work. <laughs> <laughs> All your folders that say definitely not orc porn. <laughs> mm. No. Why would I? You have no proof. 
Um, <laughs> Not yet. Are you guys like ever s afraid of like you dying and people just going through your oh your, God, your sketchbooks yeah. and your folders and they just see what nasty stuff you draw? Uh huh. Nope. Yeah. <laughs> <Jay -Z -ish. laughs> just a lie. I mean, you know. I mean, there might have been a time when that was the case. But... I have definitely seen some stuff that are like that I do not want to see again. From Jay Z. Mm. I don't, I'm not saying that. <laughs> That's author interpretation. I don't know what the heck I'm drawing anymore, guys. I've completely gone off the rails. Cool. It's mm. a good recipe for monsters. Yeah, I guess it is, huh? Yeah. I have definitely gone off the rails. No, that's fun, though. I'm excited to see what you guys do. Yeah, I'm, I'm excited to share this. I'm excited to see how, how exactly the same these are. Yeah. Because, you know, the yeah. same references, obviously. It's just going to go that way. Yeah. 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 <laughs> but. <laughs> All right, that's see. not a but. <laughs> Oh, I need a, like a textured brush because you guys are right. I think texture and detail. Texture does a lot for yeah. this sort of thing. I'm like, oh, which brush? I'm panicking. It's not time. Let's see. I wonder if like this pose I'm drawing like translates. That's my biggest concern right now. I think my, my second draft of him definitely became more muscular. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Uh, I, I still kind of prefer the first one, but it's good to explore. I guess. I'm really, I really hope that, because uh, I know some people like, like, like Bass and Ryu like to, to do challenges and stuff too. I, I really am curious, like, people who don't normally draw monsters, if they're gonna, like, dive into oh, this man. one. I, I would love so. to see Bass and Ryu draw some monsters. So would I. Yeah. I think they'd come up with some pretty cool ideas. I think so too. I really love all the stuff they post on Discord. Mm -hmm. Like they're just they're really creative and uh, I liked their what was it like delivery service C people like Oh yeah. Yeah, that was, that was super, super cool. fun. Like they just come up with their own challenges and their own I feel like they're beating us at our own game. Yeah, <laughs> I know. Right? I know. We need to like uh, get them on an episode and ask them for some ideas and like, what, what do you guys want to do? Can I challenge? Can I be? <laughs> I just have to keep reminding myself that I'm not supposed to curse. Oh. I mean. <laughs> because I, I want to curse so bad we right kinda now. Threw that rule out the I mean, window a while fuck ago. it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, but I get like I get like redundant with my cursing. It's no, I know what you mean. I feel you. I think anyone who's like played a game with me knows how bad it gets. <laughs> I'm trying to find a brush. It's hard, like when you're on a time challenge to like figure out, like ah, uh, which brush do I use? I don't know my brushes well enough, apparently. That's why yeah. I get one brush that's good for everything. Exactly. Just use my brush. That has texture. Yeah, Blow I was it up. for like kind of a, a little bit of like um, like scattered, spatter kind of a texture. Oh yeah, yeah. I think my my whole thing is definitely coming out as playful. Mine too. It's definitely what was that? I'm being such a sarcastic troll right now. What did, wait, what did you guys say? It's what? It's coming out as playful. Playful? Oh, yeah. I can't yeah. wait to see what Kale's actually looks like based on that comment. Yeah, pretty much every time I've said like what it's like, I'm just being a smartass, actually. Okay. So. How could you do that to us? <gasps> I know. Shut Here we are pouring out, you know, our art is sold to you. Yeah, it's true. Oh really? I'm on an eraser. I'm like pick picking a brush. I'm like this brush looks good. I'm I'm on my eraser right now. So I was like, ah. oops. Okay. Let's see. We... I'm just gonna do that thing where I ask Jacey about the time constantly so they don't get anything done. Yes. Victory. Cool. Way to um, <laughs> yeah. Way to cheat. That's way how to you cheat. Against... You're yeah. saying you we don't have cheat. have no proof of that. Uh, 
And yet, yeah, I have, we are, you have you know, no proof that I'm cheating. In cheat land. We have 17 yeah. minutes and 30 seconds. Dope. 29 seconds. No, it's, yeah. <laughs> if you want to know that battle, just I could draw and tell you the time. It's fine. You know, stop yeah. sure. you know, what time is down. it? 17.21. But what, what about now? <laughs> <laughs> but at what cost? Right. Let's see. Oh, oops. I don't think I have anything from the platypus. I think I did, and I like went back from it, maybe? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Did I lose? Yes. Yep. I Is that what that means? <laughs> I'm going to just s s stick a beaver tail on this thing and call it a day, man. Wow. I just honestly use the kind of claw paws that it has at the back. That's the only thing that looks usable to me. Mm. Wow. <laughs> Wow. I just imagine that I L so drew a platypus with a mask and like cat ears. <laughs> oh, that, that would have been amazing. Why didn't I yes. do that? Like, and they're only like fake, like, like fake ears that are like the, the hair tie thing. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah what, what is it called? <laughs> that thing, you know, that, that thing. <laughs> Pigtails or saying? And I don't know. I don't know anything. Same. I have to scrap my drawing now because I have to draw that. Okay. <laughs> Perfect. Um, Alright. I feel like this is like the least we've talked on one of these challenges. I feel like oh, we're it's all true. Struggling. Yeah. Let's... Oh, no. Um, well, let's, let's talk some stuff. Uh, so oh. today I went to the store <laughs> and I got really, really excited because I found some vegan spring rolls. I'm not vegan, but you know, I, I wouldn't, I won't pass off some spring rolls. Yeah, spring rolls. So I bought spring them, rolls. right? Yeah. And then I found out that, holy heck, they're like 10 uh, Norwegian money less than the meat one. And I thought, wow, it's such a bargain. Yeah, that's, that's what we call our money. 10 Isn't US it Kroner? money. Yeah, I, I hate like saying it in English because oh. I have to like switch over my tone. Gotcha, gotcha. Oh. That's pretty funny. Anyways, so uh, <laughs> I am at this store, right? And I'm just like, wow, these spring rolls. And I just, I just, I, I am so excited that I let out an audible, wow. <laughs> and I picked them up and I, I just get so excited and I dunk them into my basket. Heck yeah. <laughs> and that, that's it. That's the story. It's cool. a great story. Thank you for it's a fantastic story. this riveting content i'm excited about yep. the release of this video even more now <laughs> um, yeah i'm like all right cool. what else can i add can i just throw more eyes on this thing that's always a fun game, certainly right? all the eyes maybe in places you don't expect i'm not doing or that. I'm dead eyes. yeah <coughs> excuse me uh, Oops, that's not the right thing. I can't wait to just be done with this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know that feel? I do know that feel. Oof, that feel, am I right? Yeah. That feel. Ugh, oh, that feel when you just... No, I'm into doing this. I think this is a cool challenge. I think yeah, it's definitely different. I want to do a lot more of these. Different. <laughs> mm, sure. I was like, cool, I quit. OC Panic Hour. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye. I'm not a host anymore. Farewell. Farewell. Farewell, cruel world. <laughs> uh, no, I'm kind of into what I made. It's it's definitely different than anything else. I, I do like draw. my boy, but I do I do not think he's a monster. Oh, that's fair. Yeah. I mean, it depends who looks at him, I guess. Um, oh, let me look at the time, by the way. Let's see. We oh, okay. We're we still at 13 and a half minutes. So now good. you're cheating yourself. I see. We're doing good. Yeah, I am. I might have to put color on this eventually. I don't know. You're not doing no color? So far. Hmm. But well, then I you think lose. I should put some. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and you have to sign it. You know the rules. Oh, yeah. Yeah. If you don't sign it, it didn't count. I'm just going to start signing like that's the very first thing I do. Mm -hmm. <laughs> don't have to even think about it. No, it's, it's, a, good, it's a good move. It's a good, Power yeah, move. strategic. Yeah. You're yeah, like, you sign some, you around the 10 minute mark. That big signature energy. There we go. Should we save? I feel like that would be good. I'm oh, gonna I save. Nah, that. man. Nah. 
That's I don't. I don't like living on the edge. Else. I like being. I like being safe. <laughs> this I'm just like randomly adding texture to my background to make it look like I thought out. Like, hey, it's gritty, but it doesn't actually look like anything. There you go. Dang. All right. Let's mm. It's kind of hungry. I guess, I guess this is my monster. I guess. I still really, I feel like I didn't really add any platypus elements. <laughs> okay, here, here's, you ready? Hmm. Here's the platypus element. It lays eggs. I did it. I figured it out. You I did to draw an egg. Puzzle. Huh? <laughs> you have to draw an egg. egg. Yeah, I'm gonna. <laughs> I'm gonna. You, speak, you solved my platypus my puzzle. <laughs> yeah, that's what I feel. I feel like. <laughs> that was pretty slick, actually. I get that now. <laughs> oh, yeah, I've the been puzzle watching thing. Yeah. Or listening. God, I love that. Yeah, it's Adventures on Earth. Uh. Alright, yeah, I'm, I'm down for that. Um, I'm, I'm totally gonna draw an egg. Let's, let's give us some creepy little eggs. Nice. <laughs> Is it weird if I draw it behind it? It looks like it just laid it. <laughs> just. No. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> it's only weird if you make it weird. Yeah, don't make it weird. Don't make it come weird. Come on, JC, it's just an egg. That's true. Alright. I don't know what this egg looks like. Well, if I draw it in front of it, it looks old... like it's licking Ooh, the egg, which is weird. Does not work. I mean, you know, maybe it's into that. Yeah, that's true. That's true. So what kind of color palettes did you guys use? I'm curious. Brown. Yeah, same. Gray. Gray. Oh yeah, you didn't add color yet, right? Are you yeah. going to, or are you sticking with like grays? I haven't decided yet. Um, I mean, our rule is usually color, but I mean, I think if it's like finished, that's what counts. Like our, our rule yeah. is basically not line art, right? Like. Oh, it's definitely not line art. Yeah, it is shaded. I, yeah, then I think you're good. I think if it if that's what your creature is, you know what I mean. If that's where it's like, I think you're good. I might even have a tiny bit of value study than anything. So. Oh yeah, Pff, value. We have time for that. <laughs> I feel like value is like surprisingly hard to do. <laughs> yeah. What, like if you're like a design? digital artist. Oh. All right. Let's see. Um, I think it depends on what kind of art you do. What layer style do you guys True. use when you're doing like? just a color overlay is it hue or color or what do you tend to do uh, i prefer i prefer so i feel like hue is really hard to get it to take sometimes you know what i, I just mean? i usually just do overlay i feel like for me okay or just multiply it depends do, on what i'm drawing i'll do a color layer a lot and then i end up painting over it to get it to look better mm, does that make gotcha. sense like yeah yeah for sure this egg mm -hmm. just looks like a regular chicken egg. I need to think about how to make it more. Just monster. add some spots. That makes it exotic. <laughs> it makes it exotic. I know it's that's like the cartoon. Like, oh, that egg's creepy. Like, it's a it's a dinosaur egg now because it's got blue spots or something. Yeah, totally. Okay. I mean, some eggs do have spots, but I guess that depends on like where they laid eggs. Like, maybe they wanted to look like rocks. That you know. Yeah. Isn't like platypus eggs like squishy? Are they squishy? I don't know. I just assume that they're squishy. I've ever held one. Give <laughs> <laughs> a little squeeze. But you never yeah. held a platypus? Oh my you gosh. never squeezed a platypus egg? Come on. You haven't even Come lived. On, dude. <laughs> Did you hear like the first time scientists saw like a platypus? They thought it was like fake. They thought it was a, a hoax. And that's they tried amazing. to rip its bill off, the poor thing. Oh gosh, oh. that's yeah. less amazing. Yeah. Did they succeed? No, I, I don't think they did, but it, like they were just like poking at it thinking like you're not Well, you they do have like a poisonous like spike at the end of their leg, yeah. so maybe they got poked by it and they yeah. died, hopefully. Yeah. I mean, you know <laughs> The platypus is revenge. Yeah. Yeah. Let's write a movie about it. Yeah. That sounds good. Maybe that's what this movie will be. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This is definitely a this platypus is what they monster. Yeah, this is what they turn into. Mm-hmm. When you try to pull their bill off. This is what happens when you succeed at pulling the bill off. They turn into this. 
Ew. Just like the thought of a platypus without a bill. Yeah. It's nasty. It's kind of upsetting, yeah. It's like it's like imagining like a duck without a bill or like a bunny, but like the eyes are facing forwards. This egg is so tacked on and not thought out and it's very obvious. What's our time? It's okay. Uh we have seven and a half minutes left. Oh, okay. Dope, dope, dope. So I'm trying to figure out how do you make like an egg like I'm trying to think of like every sci fi weird thing where they they show eggs. They're always in like clusters. Yeah. Right? Make them they're slimy. slimy and they always are yeah. like plated and yeah. split open in an unnatural way. Yeah, like I'm trying to figure out how I can make this egg more interesting. I went for like a skull aesthetic, nice. but now I'm yeah. just like, it looks so stupid, so I'm adding fur on top of the skull. <laughs> so you're just kind of like build just on like top like of it like a real <laughs> creature. Yeah, pretty much. Hey, maybe the egg could be empty. I think that could work. Make it look oh my god, they lost their egg. We'll no, just, it's like, behind it, you. It's our, yeah, it's already happening. <laughs> It's licking his lips, ready to consume. Mm -hmm. like the Slurk. It's somewhere else. Maybe I need to draw a baby if it's hatched. Aww. Do you have time? No. <laughs> have time. We have six minutes. You could try. I could try. I'm still working on my egg a little bit. Um, the problem is... Ooh, that's... I Sorry. made the egg kind of like, like an obvious color. Mm -hmm. Because... It like sort of matches my creature. Like I made my creature sort of light colors, and so the egg looks oh, too yeah. light. I feel like I feel like like weird creepy eggs. Like part of it too is like they're very dark. You know what I mean? Like yeah, yeah. So they're a bit unnatural. Yeah. Mm, <laughs> I don't know. I don't overthink it. Yeah, yeah. You're probably over worried about it. It looks like a. It just looks like a giant chicken egg right now, though. It's like boring. <laughs> If I knew I was drawing an egg, I would have, like, researched, like, I, that would have included a weird egg reference, you know? <laughs> oh, I would just, like, draw an egg with, like, some legs sticking out. That would be my monster. Oh, I like that. Mm. Like, really, really long human legs. Hmm. <laughs> really long and human Of course it's naked. Yeah. I mean, like, really long toes. Okay. And, like, the toes are, like, kind of stretching, so they, they're kind of going in all directions. I'm just gonna add some goop around the egg and... Yeah. Just egg goop. I'm not sure if I like. I'm not sure if I like what I did. Oh no! But I can't fix it. I well, don't have time you to have fix it. four and a half minutes. Right, that color doesn't make sense. Yeah, I'm, I'm going in the wrong direction here. Yeah. Okay. Now it kind of looks like a, like a like a Cadbury egg or something. <laughs> it's like mm. <laughs> delicious, <laughs> tasty, yeah, tasty and weird. I, I feel like I shouldn't have told you guys. I feel like that would have been a funny reveal. Like, okay, JC, where did you incorporate a platypus? I was like, oh, haha, -ha, see. <laughs> <laughs> so, are you guys into what you you're doing? Are you into? Yeah, your... uh, my yes color no. palette is a little wonkier than I I'd, I'd like, but you know, it's it's not bad. Yeah. I'm just kind of going with the flow here. Yeah. Um. Hmm. Yeah, I see. This egg is very poorly conceived, but that's okay. I mean, how can you mess up an egg? I just, it's not very good. Like, it's just not an interesting egg. <laughs> like, I would i would want to, like, think about what makes, like... I, I kind of feel like a cluster of eggs would be creepier. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. I don't know that I have time to really do that. Mm. Maybe. Maybe... 
We have two and a half minutes left, by the way, guys. Okay, cool. Are you done, Eld? No, not really. No? I'm so surprised. I just have a natural calm to my voice. Yeah, you, you kind of <laughs> do. It's, it's eerie. Mm. It's the real horror. <laughs> I was the real monster all along. <gasps> now I will suck your blood. <laughs> oh god, I hate that sound. No, no. Oh, that's the worst audio. Stop. No, stop. <laughs> I sucked in so much air during that. Oh, man. <laughs> My sister does that too to like freak me out. She'll just like look at me and slurp. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I forgot we've been recording face on some of this stuff, so you guys can definitely see my my facial reactions. Nice. Yeah. I'm looking forward to that. Cool. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hey, guess what, folks? You know? I'm done. Yeah. Yeah, cool. you got a minute and forty seconds to sign your name. Oh boy. Oh boy. It's gonna be the best looking signature. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I'll I'll sign it now. I signed it in red, like blood red, even though I always signed it in red. Yeah. But this time. Eld. Crind. I'm still drawing my eggs, my little eggies. And a smiley face. Eh, that's good enough. I don't really care if this is like. Eh. It looks like it's like trying to eat the eggs. So I think I actually am happy with the face, now that I'm done with like adding highlights to the eyes. Cool. Oops. No, that's great. Uh, let's see. Whoops. Do you think our challenge was extra challenging or no? Yeah, but I think the real challenge I was feel how very comfortable in. So, you know, mm -hmm. like I, I don't think that like us actually getting done means oh. it wasn't good or anything. Signed it 2018. I, I know what year it is. I think for me, uh, okay. um, the real challenge was that we didn't have any time to prep our references. Mm -hmm. The so, real challenge uh, was the friends we made along the way. Yeah. 20 True seconds that. Left, by the way, guys. How long? Uh, 20 seconds. If you want to add oh, any okay. last minute uh, little details. 15 little seconds. Deets. Get down to the wire. Um, I'm going to do... I guess I'm done. Are you done, and Jason? Yeah, I'm oh. done. Okay. Alright, we're done. Time's up. Cool. Should I show off, like, both of the attempts at the same time? Alright, let me actually save uh, this now. Both of them at the same time? <laughs> uh, that's up Ooh, to can you. Can we do, like, a spoiler post for these to show them to each other? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah I yeah, love yeah. that feature in Discord. Okay. I'm so oh, Can we do dark. these, like, one by one? Or yeah, one let's thing? do one by one. Is that how you okay. want to do it? Alright, so I see right. Elds here oh. first. Okay. Yeah. 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 Let's All right, click that. And, and one, two, three. Ooh. Whoa! Oh, that's so cool. Oh wow! All right, do you want to talk uh, about it before we move on? Yeah, or do you want to look at them all first? Okay. Uh, huh? I feel like this has like a, a like an ape vibe to me. Mm hmm. See, the I tail just... is giving me like a horse sort of thing. Oh yeah, the yeah. The, the tail definitely feels horse, Big. but yeah. just like the overall body type and shape just feels like and like with the fur. Yeah. There's the face. Yeah, Ooh. I love that face. That's wild. Yeah, it looked kind of stupid without like the scratches. Like it just looked uh, too smooth. Yeah. I like that. It's kind of like a bone plate, though, right? Yeah. That's yeah. Sort of what's there. So, can you talk us through the inspiration? So, like, that's yeah. kind of like the mask inspiration, I would imagine, right? Like. Yeah. So the, the obviously the mask and also the <laughs> hair, since I added the tail, I kind of wanted to be. A, super super fluffy but you, you don't really have that time in an hour <laughs> right. and the first drawing i totally drew the legs drawing and i was like yeah we could keep that but then i realized <laughs> nah <laughs> I, I don't care <laughs> uh so i i spent i think most of the time actually on the second post just trying to find something that didn't look as dorky because i just felt like <laughs> okay. it was too dorky in the first one because it kind of looks like he just like fell over and he, he just stuff that someone yeah, and, i didn't you know, want to say that and he's like oopsie daisy <laughs> you know that's kind of what the first drawing yeah and now me. he's ready to pounce which like, yeah definitely feels yeah. better or he's ready for uh hmm, it's the cat little... meat pose <laughs> yeah yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, meow. <laughs> I I really I, I have to say the back feet that's the platypus right? You, like yep. got the little flippers. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Good nice. job. Nice. Way to work it in. 
And I feel like his front yeah. paws kind of remind me of the the one creature that Kale. Uh, yeah, that okay. one. Yeah, yeah. Which one? Kind of like his, <laughs> the, his uh... back paws. Yeah, well, like oh, yeah. Uh, the yeah, little flying just... thing. Oh, oh yeah. no! See, I was thinking the front feet of Eld's character kind of remind me of the. Uh, the, 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 the dog like, thing? Thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. yeah, I definitely went for, like, the eyes of the dog. Mm -hmm. mm. And uh, the fur of the cat, because it's, like, too toned. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's really it. That's really That's all there is cool. to it. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like the contortionist influence just kind of fell apart, because it, it did look like he just kind of fell over. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, I see why. I think it's a smart change. I, I that was an amazing yeah. challenge, though. Like trying to figure out the contortionist one. Yeah. All right. Do you guys want to move on to? Yeah. Yeah. Let's line? see JC's. All right. Yeah. All right. Three, two, one. Cacao. Oh. Oh, see, yours is scary. That's awesome. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it really does look like it's licking it. It does. Yeah. It's like licking the eggs open. Mmm. That is. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe maybe that's super them. cool. <laughs> I think uh, it's extra creepy just because of the hair tentacles. Yeah. Yeah. So looks like Yeah, that was kind of influenced by the doll that you uh, shared Eld with, like that kind of wild oh, hair. Yeah. I thought that's cool. Mm -hmm. Like, let me that's like a neat that. in between of that. And yeah. The, the dog. Yeah, yeah. Or monster. Um, oh, I didn't even notice that he has another set of legs. Yeah. yeah. They got that's too many. I was so focused on the hair. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I do want to ask the the eyes are those like shines on them or are those eyes like within kind of a recessed thing? Uh, I was as... picturing them as like shines. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah. I dig it. Because my first reaction to that mm -hmm. is um, oh, what's the word for it? Uh, oh, that tryptophobic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tryptophobia. Because yeah. oh, yeah. I saw that as kind of like lotus holes Little and there's holes. like eyes down in it and that immediately made me squicky with it. And I yeah, was very I impressed. actually. When you said that, I was like, oh, that would have been cooler. <laughs> <laughs> I No, I like that better. Um, well, and the, the reference you had kind of had that vibe a little bit mm -hmm. of, like, the weird, like, recessed eyes. I don't know. Yeah. Um, I dig it. I dig it. Yeah. Yeah, there... the eggs were a nice addition. I think that really, like, suddenly now I feel like this is a creature you'd find somewhere and like you... be very, very disappointed that you ran across. Like, yeah. Really cool. <laughs> yeah, like, there's more of these, too. You would realize yeah. that, would, that would be freaky. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's funny because the, the platypus kind of made me force that in, but I do think it works. I, I like yeah. it. Um, <laughs> it. It has a scene to it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's a very nice environment work in. That's cool. cool. Um, all right, I'm nice. really excited to see yours, Kale. Are you ready? Okay, I'm ready. Three, right. two, one. Oh, oh wow. wow. Wait, you were like, oh, there's no color, and then you got all this beautiful color. Yeah, I, it, I did that in, like, the last week. ten minutes or something. No, it's really cool. Okay, wow. Uh, I really I'm definitely see, the I'm seeing thing. the no face. Yeah. The influence <laughs> there. Yeah. That's really cool. And the contortion is... Oh, okay, okay, wait. I have to give you mad props. You created... I think in my head, that's the kind of mm -hmm. thing that I wanted to make originally. But I didn't <laughs> yeah. know how to make it work. Of, like... When I saw that contortionist, I thought, "Oh, that would be cool for like a Silent Hill messed oh, yeah, up." Yeah. You you nailed what I would have wanted to where do. I went with that. Thank um, you. I struggled a lot with trying to figure out how do I make this weird twisted body. You nailed it. That's great. <laughs> yes. I'm I'm really glad that that ended up being uh, an influence on this because I think you made a really cool creature. Thanks. Yeah, right, where'd you I'm, work I'm in the platypus? I'm super happy with this. Oh, All right, big, I'm gonna big say. Claw? The long arms with the, the claws mm -hmm. is kind of like the back legs of the platypus. The claws. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. No, that works. I it's really like, like, it's like... That's my cop-out like answer. No, it <laughs> works. It works. Is, is it like two creatures in one? Or is it like the face is like a fake? It's like a fake is what I was thinking. It's like you would oh, look up okay. at this very tall thing. Because zoom in on the mouth down there. Yeah, that's, that. that's a... Yeah, that's nasty. <laughs> yeah. Um. <laughs> oh, ew! ew that's <laughs> just a slide. In it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. wow! Like a human face down in there. Yeah, and that's what like the tongue's actually coming it. out of. Ew. Ew. <laughs> so is this like a human that's been deformed, or is it just been consumed? Uh, no. I I mm -hmm. think this is just part of the monster that looks like a human. There is no human element ew. to this. It's just okay. something there. Um, and I, I love that kind of stuff. Just like monsters with human features 
are very upsetting to me. Yeah, so me too. I, I dig that stuff in horror. I like this um, a lot. Thank it you. It really reminds me of a saw because of the arms. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 It did kind of end up going that direction a bit. I could see those arms moving actually like really slow, and all the bottom is pretty quick. Ew, Ooh, yeah. that's even worse. Can you imagine fighting <laughs> like this thing I, in a game? Like, I, I just ugh. imagine like hearing like the the, le the leg arms just. Yes. <laughs> 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 yeah. Uh, no, oh I have God. to say too. I really like uh, the way you incorporated um, sort of that flying creature has those like sort of like weird long ears and. Mm -hmm. You sort of incorporated that into the yeah. Face of the try it's really cool, like the way I think the colors came together really cool too. Like you took influence. From I'm surprised how much I like it with this much color. Like it's yeah. a fairly bright creature. It's very actually. bright. Yeah. Um, I imagine that like lighting up a cave. You know what yeah. I mean? Like it would look yeah. really cool in like a creepy weird cave. I did finally decide that like its back is kind of like turning gelatinous again, like that sort of Mononoke yeah. creature, and it's glowing mm -hmm. internally. Yeah. I started doing that when we were talking about the nightmare creature that I was telling you guys about. Yeah. That would, like, pull me in. Like, that's kind of the texture it had. That's cool. Um, yeah, it's terrifying, but <laughs> sorry if I had <laughs> nightmares like that. <laughs> yeah. No, that's all right. It's good inspiration. Uh, no, I want to send you guys, like, the black and white version, because I still oh, yeah. really like the way that looks, too. Like, I'm happy with the color, but I really did. Oh, yeah, Missy's seeing all these. Yeah, Missy's like, whoa. <laughs> Oh, yeah. yeah. So there's, like, the original black and white. Okay. I kind of prefer it with the color. Yeah? Yeah, I do, too. I feel like the fleshy tone really makes it nasty. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I would probably lean more into the fleshy stuff. Like, I wanted mm -hmm. to try and, like, incorporate that little flying monster I had. So I was like, green. okay, green. Yeah. It's actually but really then... pretty. <laughs> it is. It's weirdly pretty. It's a pretty, pretty. Palette, palette, yeah. Yeah. I like it. Um... Yeah, I, I don't know that I would keep this palette, but I would keep it this direction, at least. Yeah. yeah. This uh, was a fun challenge. This was. I'm so happy we finally did this. This was definitely yeah. a challenge. I, <laughs> I, I really have to say, I'm, I'm glad that I, like, pushed myself with something, uh, yeah. like, outside of what my comfort zone is, yeah. and I think I made something kind of cool. Um, seeing yours, I feel like you who is someone who makes monsters I, I feel like you took that to another level which is really cool Thank so you. i think this is a cool challenge for someone who is either brand new to drawing monsters or loves it and just wants to like come up with a new just way to approach cut it loose because yeah. I, I think coming up with like okay here's some random influences and i'm gonna try to work them in like it's a cool creative tool like i think mm -hmm. I, I, you really ran with it and that's awesome I, I think you understood like what to do with those parts very well and it shows it's dope yeah, I mean, my one regret is that I didn't give it a beaver tail. Oh well, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, obviously. <laughs> True no. horror. <laughs> no, God, that was such a curveball. Good job on adding that in. Yeah, it's really good. <sighs> it's just like, ah, oh, shit. Of course, there's a. I feel like we did this in an well, hour. I was like, I was, like, I was googling like clay dolls, and like a clay oh, doll yeah. of a really cute platypus came up. I was like, oh, that's perfect. Oh, that's neat. Nice. I just thought it was really cute. <laughs> <laughs> fair. Great. Fair. Awesome. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you played along with this challenge, please uh, share it with us. Show us what you did. Yeah. Join our Discord server and mm -hmm. share all of your art and writing and cool, creative adventures. Yeah. You can mm -hmm. also find each of us on twitch.tv with our respective usernames. Yeah, there's... And, yeah. We'll put a bunch Come of links out. all over the place. And, yeah, uh, down the doodly doo. Go yeah. check it out. All right, cool. All right, all thanks, right. guys. I'll <laughs> talk to you later. Bye. Bye. Bye.